while this is an alum battery conversion video this is a 150h uh, excite inverter battery which is there already so I'm gonna convert it to from lead acid to lead alum okay here some alum stones I didn't get alum powder so I got stones and I need to uh, dissolve it in water this is distilled water and I'm gonna do it in this bucket but first of all what you're gonna do is you need to dump the acid from the battery into a bucket and neutralize it with the baking soda and then clean the battery with the uh, baking soda 8 ounce of baking soda into a gallon of water mix it and then pour it in each cells and then uh, leave it for uh, a few minutes or few hours and then dump it I've done the baking soda water and I uh, can see the plate inside now I'm gonna clean it with water again and then I'm gonna pour the alum well, water mix These are the alum stones in the water. It's gonna dissolve, but it gonna it's gonna take some time. All right. So all the cleaning process. Uh, it's done and now I'm gonna fill this battery with the uh, alum water mix this to jar are uh, filled with the alum water mix and uh, let me remind you this uh, this is not something uh, I am I experienced it and I am showing you to do it this is something that uh, I am going to experience it right now and uh, this is kind of made spread uh, almost all over the world and on internet that you can uh, bring a dead battery back to the life uh, using alum so uh, now I'm just gonna uh, test it that uh, this may not really uh, works or no so let me tell you once again when you're dealing with the uh, lead acid battery I always use the safety gears like eyeglasses and cover your face uh, I mean face mask and use gloves and shoes and full sleeve uh, shirt like that and first of all dump the acid into a bucket and then neutralize it with uh, baking soda water then you clean the battery with baking soda water and after that you can clean it with uh, distilled water again and then you can you uh, pour it in the alum water mix so until that I uh, clean this battery uh, twice using the baking soda water and then clean it again with distilled water and now I'm gonna use the alum water mix so let's do it
All right, the work is done. As you can see, all the cells are filled with L water mixed. And now I'm gonna put it on charging. I'm gonna use a uh, 5M charger. This is a uh, 150H battery. It uh, the inverter is an uh, inverter battery, so inverter gives it uh, charge at uh, 15 amps. But I'm going to use a 5 amp because after you uh, <coughs> uh, convert the battery, you need to charge it slowly. So I'm going to use a 5 amp charge, and I'm going to put it in charge for uh, 24 hours, and then we'll see uh, the progress.